Welcome back to Everyday. Now, have you ever listened to the blues? Well, our community radio station in Hamilton is going to give you that opportunity. They already are giving you that opportunity. And here today to tell us all about it is the host of The Blue Room, Nate Tyapa, and the general manager of the radio station, Phil, is here also. Welcome to Everyday, guys. Good, thank you. Now, tell me about The Blues Room. It sounds so much fun. Why did you want to be involved? Well, I uh, have a huge... Uh collection of music, blues music, and um, it was actually one of the uh, uh, staff up there at uh, Community Radio Hamilton who said to me the then at the time uh, host of the blues show was about to leave and uh, would I be interested in uh, hosting the show and I, I, I thought no, nah, not really, but uh, he kept uh, persisting and came back to me. I uh, eventually said, yeah, I'll give it a go and uh, went on up there and uh, got trained up by all the staff there and gave it a go. And it's, it's a lot of fun? It's a lot of fun, meeting a lot of people, um, both uh, nationally around New Zealand and also uh, Australia, in fact all over the world really. Yeah, and now Phil, mm. I know with the Blues Room, that's only just one of the shows available on community mm. radio, um, there's a whole heap isn't there? Oh, massive, massive number of shows. Uh, around 100 shows every week broadcast out of our studios. Um, and, and a huge range of stuff, not only the, you know, these great specialist music shows that people like Nate host, but uh, a whole range of community type shows and, and particularly ethnic communities as well. And that's got to be good to be able to get them out there and get their message across. Well, that's what our job yeah. is. You know, we're, we're a community access radio station, so our funding is, is all about us providing access to the media for sectors of society who don't otherwise get a chance to engage directly in the media. That, that's the role of an access station. That's what Community Radio Hamilton's all about. And I know you're doing a very good job at it, aren't you? Well, you know, a whole team of people doing yeah. it. It's really the volunteers that make the radio. You know, these, these guys that come and put the effort in and make the shows. Well, because I know, Nate, with the blues room, I mean, everyone's got a little bit of a different definition of what exactly blues is. So what is it for you? Yeah, it's had a, had a bit of a slack reputation, I guess, over the years. But um, I don't know, I think Ben Harper kind of summed it all up when he said uh, blues music is soul music and I think that's what it is really, it's, it's, it's a music that has a, a feeling and I guess it's come about from the ground up really, quite literally with uh, field hollers and juke joints and you know uh, back porches or front porches um, and basically uh, it's starting out acoustically um, with uh, the uh, American Negroes and you know it's, it's, it's evolved to become quite intertwined in, in a lot of uh, musics throughout the world. So, I don't know, I think I'd just sum it up as uh, soul music, music for the soul. Yeah, and I know you've got quite a big following now, haven't you? That would be nice. <laughs> <It's>, um, <laughs> I, I think it's growing, I think it's growing. I mean, you, I, I guess you can't really ever know how many people are listening to the radio, but the amount of people that uh, let me know they're listening is, is, is good feedback. Uh, particularly around Hamilton. Uh, now with the uh, station having gone live on the internet, uh, I'm getting people tuning in from uh, all over the world. So that's, that's exciting too. Gosh, I mean, that's the whole thing. I mean, the whole community radio station in Hamilton, it's just growing and expanding, mm. not only in content and the different shows you've got on, but also in, in the ways that you can actually broadcast. That's right. And, mm. and part of our strategy over the last couple of years has been using the internet. So we now stream to the whole planet. 24 hours a day. We podcast a lot of our shows and we're getting a big international listenership. You know, people from all over the world are checking out our shows, which is great. It's, you know, it's very exciting for the broadcasters. So tell me about community radio. How is it different to our normal commercial radio? Very different. The main thing is that our broadcasters are volunteers. They're ordinary people who we train up, but they're not professional DJs. You know, they're volunteering their time. And it's also, it's about people saying the things they want to say, talking to their own community. So a migrant community group will have some airtime. They'll be talking to their community without uh, somebody telling them what they can and can't talk about. So it's in their language, it's their issues, their, you know, their, their problems that are being resolved through, through the media. Gosh, that's fantastic. And it, mm -hmm. even though it is everyday people, I mean, people might think community radio, lower standard, not as great as commercial radio, but I mean, you, you're training these people up. Mm. And to hear that there's different languages mm. on a Hamilton radio station is fantastic. People don't need to worry about sounding like a commercial professional mm. DJ. We're not too worried about that. People don't speak like commercial radio DJs in real life. Why should they on the radio? Exactly. Mm. Now the Blues Room. I know you have a lot of fun with that show. It's happening on yeah. a Wednesday night, isn't Wednesday it? Wednesday night, 9 p.m. Oh, excellent. So how much preparation do you do for the show? 
as much or as little as I can. <laughs> I guess um, I, I guess throughout the week I, I'll, I'll think of a, a theme, and uh, then start to collect to so put put together a bit of a, a collection of music that I can then play. And I, as I understand, do you uh, play a little bit of your harmonica on the show as well? Yeah, I have actually played it on the show. Uh, we've had a, a, a band in there. We've had a big double bass, drums, guitar. Okay. I'm only too happy to have uh, local musicians come into the studio. We can set that up and have, a, have an on-set oh jam. God. So should we have a little bit of a listen here on you sure, and your harmonica? Sure. Join, Go join for in. It. There's a couple of harmonicas there. Oh, really? <laughs> I, I, I don't really know if you want me to do it. Go for we'll it. Swing this around. Swing, and yeah. See how we go. Take it away. Gosh, that was fantastic. Thank you so much Thank for coming you. on uh, to Every Day, guys. It's wonderful. And if you would like to hear more of the harmonica playing or you'd like to check out Community Radio in Hamilton, you can do so. You can pop on to the Blues Room. It's on from 9 till 10.30pm every Wednesday. The station numbers are 12.06am in the Waikato or the 106.7 FM in Hamilton. And the, radio, uh, the website there is communityradio.co.nz.